Welcome back to another video. Um, you're back with Samapa. Um, and just before we start, I just want to say thanks for enjoying all the shorts if you guys are. Um, and if you are from here from the shorts, you know, give a like and sub and check out some of the other channel videos. You know, I've been posting for 10 years or so. But um, yeah, if you enjoy, leave a like. It does really help. And leave a sub. But today, um, we're over streaming and, you know, we've got some stream highlights up. Um, and a lot of people commenting on my inventory now. It's not the best inventory in the world, but it's a yellow themed inventory and I put a little effort into it. Um, it's not worth that much money, but for like the normal person, it's pretty nice. Um, so I thought today we'd go back and we'd have a look at my inventory and what, what I've got going on. Um, and I've actually pulled up my old inventory that back in the day, it was 2017 on CSGO backpack. It was worth about, yeah, 1200 bucks, which I've done. I've got a separate tab here and I've done, I've done the, the prices. It's about $1,300, $1,400 today, but I thought it'd be fun to go back and have a look at what I had um, to what I have now and if there's price difference and then just, yeah, just a just an inventory showcase. So I'm on my Steam page um, and I had a couple of screenshots here um, from back of like what my skins used to be. Um, and there's some pretty crazy ones in here that I can't like, you just look back and you can't even believe it. But like, you know, I got like a Cyrex, a Chameleon, as uh, a Hyper Beast, Golden Koi, I had a field tested Vulcan, which are worth like $300 now. Um, a kill confirmed, which back in the day, that was like, I don't know, 20 bucks maybe. It was like a red brand new case and now it's worth like $300. It's a fact new kill confirmed. It's like crazy fire elementals. Now I don't have all this put into the, the trade website, but the biggest one here I want to focus on is my Cheetos. And I called it Bayonet Cheetos. And I remember this was like, you know, 70 comp wins. I'm new to CS. I think I dropped all this money into this game. Um, and then this is when the gambling was happen, happening. And um, I just gambled it all away on a gambling side as, you know, as you did back then. Um, very stupid, very stupid. But uh, looking through like on the screenshots that I thought were cool guns was obviously my Hyper Beast. And that's either a Minwear or a Fact New because um, it's very clean. I think it's Factory New, I don't know. Um, but I got a big iron. Got my golden koi. Um, of course, I had a Cyrix we saw before. You know, Neon Rider was just the classic, like, it still is the classic red that everybody can have. Um, and now that's either a field test or a minware fucking Vulcan. I don't know which one it was, but it's clean. Like, it's crazy. It's cleaner than, cleaner than my Vulcan that I have now, um, which we'll get to. And then, yeah, just some other guns. Um, and then, of course, yeah, the kill confirmed. Crazy. Craziness. It's either fact new or minware. Might be minware, but still just absolutely nuts. Ridiculous that I ever got rid of that. Um, and then, yeah, my pride and joy was my Bayo Cheetos. Uh, I love this thing. It was a minware uh, Bayo Tiger Tooth. And I've wanted this back for the longest time. Like, I wanted it back for so long. Um, and that's the one that I lost. Yeah, I lost to Galen because I'm so stupid. So, yeah, over on like um, swap.gg, which I use for some of my skin trading, I put in some of those older skins that I have, like the Vulcan is just ridiculous, $206. Like the one I got now is only a hundred, um, but the kill confirmed is another one. Uh, and then the Bayo Tiger Tooth, of course. Big skins that I lost back in the day, but it, was, it wasn't worth what my inventory is worth now. So I'm definitely doing better these days than I was back then. Um, but yeah, I just can't, can't believe I gambled a lot away. Nothing to brag about, but it's just, you know, pretty cool if anybody cares about that stuff. Of course, you can just look all this stuff up. Oh, no, I'm CSGO Backpack anyway. You know, it's all it's all public. I've got a public uh, inventory anyway, so yeah. So here we are today in today's world, and um, this is this is what it looks like now. So this is my inventory. Um, so, of course, I got my Cheetos back. I needed my Cheetos. Um, now I, I do I do roll with like the yellow themed inventory. Yeah, so like I roll with the yellow themed inventory. I like yellow. Yellow is my favorite color. So of course in my screenshots I've got a couple of my yellow guns. Yeah, so the yellow. So in my actual inventory, this is my loadout. This is what I use on the daily. Now I couldn't afford a yellow um, deagle, so I've got a deagle conspiracy with some Navi stickers on it, and it looks really cool, like in game. Like it looks looks really dope. And we'll go through the guns in game. Oh, we'll do it actually. So yeah, in game. It looks really cool. It kind of suits the whole like, I don't even know how you meant to do that. look up like this, I guess. It suits the whole uh, yellow theme. It looks pretty cool. Of course the gloves help as well. But uh, yeah, I, I think it looks pretty sick. So yeah, the Desert Eagle. Um, and then I've got a Torque. Uh, and for, i got an Amber Fade from the outside. 
disgusting looking ammo fade. Like, I just got some disgusting skins, but I don't really use it. Um, but then, yeah, I got the torque. It's only in field testing, I'm pretty sure. Um, I don't know, it's in fact new. Lol. Okay, it just doesn't look that great to me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I got the torque. I, I would love an Orion, but I just can't afford it. Um, Beretta's wing shot for both teams. I got an Azzy as well if I need it, and then Lucky Business for both teams. But then, got the yellow jacket if I need it. Another one of those guns that I used to use all the time, but I don't use the CZ anymore. Um, for the SMGs, I didn't, I couldn't afford like a bulldozer and all that, so I've just gone a little bit crazy. Where I do have like a bio leak that if I wanted to have, yeah, like a, uh, have a bit of a um, yellow theme or whatever, I could go for it. But I mainly just use a nice, colorful food chain. Um, and I got yeah the phosphor. And I got just a blaze. I got an Arctic blaze as well, which doesn't have any yellow on it. But if I put some Navi skins on it, it would look pretty cool, like the Deagle. Shape wood, because nice default. I should probably just get an Nazi, but it's kind of yellow, so I kind of go with it. <laughs> and then, yeah, just a jungle of Anubis. Judgment of Anubis, sorry. Um, and then the rifles. These are the cool ones. This is what everybody likes to see. Um, oh, I didn't show you the MAC-10. The MAC-10 is just a stalker. But I got a Neon Rider as well, like I said. Classic skin. <laughs> um, so, yeah, the rifles. Got a Chatterbox. I go around the chatterbox, nice yellow chatterbox. Hardly ever used the Galil, so yeah. Um, we'll have to go through some of these other skins like another time. But um, in terms of like my loadout, I do use the Vulcan on the daily um, with some stick uh, these stickers on it. I don't know what these stickers are. They just came with the gun, so I'm not sure. It's a field tested Vulcan um, stat track. I love it. I love. I mean, not Vulcan. Uh, Azzy. I love the Azzy. Um, Azzy mold with the Half Life stickers on them. I think they look really cool. Um, yeah, I just, I, I like using it on the reg, but I, of course I do have the fuel rod just, you know, just uh, to really stick with that. Um, stick with the yellow themed inventory. It's a midwear fuel rod. It's worth quite a lot of money. It's pretty cool. Um, I got my, some other skins. I just got some other like uh, AK skins that I've picked up along the way for no reason other than I just like having them. But of course, I've got my field tested Vulcan. Oh, well worn Vulcan, sorry. Again, it looks nothing like that one in the picture that I took. So maybe the one in the picture is a fact. Can you even get them in fact new? I don't know. I don't know a lot about skins, but I know that I like looking at them. So I have them um, with the Stewie 2K sticker. Not that it means anything. It's on the fucking Vulcan. And it's, yeah, probably not going to be worth that much anyway. But I do have a slate. The slate looks very clean. I like like one of these with the Navi stickers on it as well. I'm thinking about doing that. That would be fucking awesome, I reckon. I reckon that looks sick. Um, and then I got my first skin ever and first time I put a sticker on a gun ever. That's just because I like having it around. <laughs> and then on the CT side, I rock the Golden Koi. Um, of course, I got some other got some other skins, but I rock the Golden Koi um, and then I got a Living Color, Star Trek Living Color for my M4, A4 if I want to use it. Um, and then the Chameleon. Um, and then just a big iron as a scout and then the AWP I run with the the boomstick, but I got um, I got Hyper Beast. I got a Star Trek 4 as well. I think that just looks pretty cool. Xylo sticker um, Not that it's worth a lot of money But yeah, the boomstick definitely the cool one um, And then yeah, the, you can just have a look at the other ones, but yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much all I rock with um, I got my AK here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. That's my Azzy. Looks pretty cool. I enjoy it. I think it looks awesome. Um, then oh, I'm on the wrong team, but I'll show you another time. I got my, uh, my hyper beast. Looks also very cool. Oh, I did not show you my uh, my gloves. So I'll show you my gloves with my skin. Um, so I got my Bayo Cheeto, Cheetos back, of course. Um, always wanted this one back. I don't think it's as nice as my first one that I had, but it's still pretty cool. Um, so. The Cheetos, and then I got the gloves. So they're driver gloves, something. What are they? Loadout gloves, overtake. Driver glove, overtake. So yeah, they just kind of with the yellow and the black. Looks pretty cool. I think they're only field tested. Battle scarred, lol. Um, but they look pretty cool in game. Like I don't mind the whole wear on the gloves because it's kind of like you're using it, kind of like you're not. So yeah, looks pretty sick. But I got my uh, driver glove. Driver gloves overtake as well with the Cheetos. So pretty cool, uh, pretty cool loadout all together, I think. So back on the CT side now. Um, of course, got the USPS, my um, torque. 
which is a pretty easy one to use. Um, and then, yeah, my Golden Koi with some Fnatic stickers on there. The skins look terrible, probably, because I haven't turned all my res up, but this is how I play the game. <laughs> it's just looking like, like this. Um, and then, yeah, of course, my Hyper Beast. I love the Boomstick. It's got a little Titan Cato 2015 on the back of it. Probably doesn't mean anything. It's on the skin, but I don't know. Worth mentioning, because I know some of them are worth something. I think it has to be a Titan Hollow or something. I don't know. Don't crucify me. Um, but... Is bought armor for some reason. I'm also obviously going into a firefight. Um, but yeah, so there's some of my skins. Um, I thought I'd just make this quick little video because uh, you guys picked up on it on the stream. More so to plug my stream. If you guys enjoy watching CSGO live, uh, me and my brother do dual cam. I'm sure you've seen some of the shorts. If you haven't, check them out. Um, if you are here from the shorts, thank you very much for being here. Um, I love posting them. We have some very funny moments. We have some good fun. So. Drop on by, have a look. We stream most nights a week. Um, I'm always playing CS. Um, but anyway, you know, the Major's on, so enjoy the Rio Major. I'm definitely enjoying the Rio Major. Uh, be responsible with skin buying. If you are in the gambling, like I said, be very responsible with your gambling. Um, don't be silly and lose your cool skins. Um, talking about losing your cool skins, on the other thing, I do have some Tiger Tooth butt plugs too. I call them squat plugs. Anyway, I'm gonna end it there. Thank you very much for watching. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed, leave a like, leave a sub, and I'll uh, see you in the next video.